Grell Stephen is going to be a great pleasure. I'm looking forward so much to us doing the list first piano concerto together. Me too. It's a Liverpool. wonderful piece to play. It's short, of course. It's all around 20 minutes, but just a wonderfully constructed piece. Uh, it's four sections, but one movement in a way, and uh, so clever and so witty and so um, virtuosic and full of life. The thing that gets me about it, when it was first performed, it must have knocked the socks off people who heard it. Yeah. Because what what when you think how early it was written. Absolutely. I mean, this is the thing with Liszt is, you know, he was just breaking the rules and breaking ground every single piece he wrote. And these pieces, yeah, you feel that he's stretching the instrument to its absolute limits. And then they built a bit more onto it and he stretches that. I mean, it's like limitless energy that Liszt has. What the interesting little tie-up for me is that the fact that the first performance... Liszt was the soloist, yeah. and Berlioz was the conductor. Yeah. Now, what a, what a combination that oh, was. When you think yeah. Berlioz took the orchestra out yeah. of the classical era yeah. and changed it into something completely different, yeah. Liszt did the same thing yeah. with the piano. Wouldn't it have been wonderful to hear that concert? Oh. It's a little bit like 100 years later, uh, Rachmaninoff and, and Mahler doing the third piano concerto in New York. It was not the premiere, but it, I think it was the second performance of the piece. It's another of those concerts that would have been marvellous to, to be able to do a bit of time travelling. And how interesting to hear, that's obviously where Rachmaninoff got a lot of his technical writing. When you hear, especially you've, you've been playing this lovely recital in this wonderful church this afternoon, you played some of the, um, the list etude yeah. at the end, yeah. very Rachmaninoff in style, yeah, very much. and you can yeah. see the, the bridge that was being made yeah. between the eras, astonishing to hear. Yeah. Well, everyone built on Liszt, really, you know, he was the foundation mm. for anything that we do with this instrument, the piano, has something um, in, in tribute to Liszt in a way. And we're looking forward to you playing in St George's Hall concert room, which I don't believe you've played in before. I've never been in it, but I've heard only, of course, glowing. People's faces light up when you mm. mention this hall, because not only are the acoustics wonderful, but it's a gorgeous-looking place. So, it, It's like a little hall out of Central Europe. Right. The sort yeah. of, it's gold and red and beautiful, yeah. with a wonderful chandelier hanging in the middle. It's, it's a glorious place. Oh, looking forward very it much really to playing is. there. Thank you. 